Ready? Southwest Florida, welcome to another edition of Lee Pitts Live. You are looking live at the Mount Hermon Ministries Fun Day that's taking place here at Mount Hermon Christian Church right here in the heart of Dunbar. It is a spectacular event and Lee Pitts Live is the media sponsor and we've come out here to cover this event from gavel to gavel. It is the event of the year. Mount Hermon Ministries is under the leadership of Dr. William Glover, the pastor, and Cheryl Glover, the first lady. Right here is Martin Bird. Let's just call him Mr. Logistics. He handles the Dunbar Easter Parade. He handles the Martin Luther King Day weekend. He handles it all. This young guy, of course, will be the first black mayor of Fort Myers uh, in a few years from now. But right now, let's continue to put him on TV so I can have this documented that I interviewed the mayor before he was the mayor. Thank you very Welcome much. Welcome to the show, Mr. Mayor. Thank you very much. Anytime, <laughs> Lee, anytime. Now, you trying to out-cool me, man, with those shades? No, I'm, I'm just trying to take some pointers. That's all I'm learning. I'm learning. Well, I want to thank you, first of all, for handling logistics and, and treating Lee Pitts Live with royalty. Uh, brought us in here first class, got everything set up properly. And uh, who's, who's, just shout out our cameraman right quick. I'll be going to shout out uh, little Cicero McCarter helping us out on the uh, camera, one of our great youth ministry members. Now, Martin. Paint the picture for us of what's taking place here today. Uh, what happens to be the biggest event happening here on the Mount Hermon campus, um, put on by both Mount Hermon Ministries and a nonprofit created by our uh, pastors, Cheryl and uh, William, the Redeeming Influence Community Outreach Program. We have 200 to 300 families, over 1,000 people walking around this campus, diabetes form, fun day, free backpacks, giveaways, Food, fire truck, Harry Chapin Bank, everything. Even Jackie's photos is here. <laughs> oh, Jackie Magic Touch. <laughs> now, uh, when people leave here today, what do you hope they will have accomplished with their kids, with their health, and everything else? That they leave, one, informed. We had a great speaker. Um, he was an Ironman triathlete. Um, knowing that diabetes, whether if they have it or they don't have it, it's not a hindrance. And if they don't have it, to way they know the right steps to continue to stay healthy as well as leaving with something a piece of a feeling of community feeling that they have a ministry uh, here in my Herman and the Redeeming Influence Community Outreach organization that are looking out for them and is looking to reach in the community for them. Okay and we're gonna get a sister Cheryl over here soon to talk to her but Martin tell me some of the partners that are out here participating in this and while you're doing that we'll have our cameraman slowly pan, slowly, and take a look at some of the kids who are getting book bags and things and school supplies as well. Go ahead. All right. This the event is made by the partners. Uh, first, of course, the only reason you're seeing this is because we have a media sponsor by the name of Lee Pitts Live. Um, Shout out. <laughs> always, we appreciate that, Lee, as well as our main health partner in Lee Health. Uh, we want to thank the CEO, Dr. Antolucci, uh, um, for providing both the speaker and the nurses that were here checking blood pressures, looking at different health vitals. Canona Ice is out here. The fire uh, truck, thanks to the city of Fort Myers. Uh, Harry Chapin uh, food giving bank. away food to the uh, people of the community. Lee Memorial's uh, food Blood Center here as well, as well as the living uh, Healthy Living Bus from the Lee County School District. And I understand last year, it was just as many people out here. We usually get up to a close to a, a thousand people. People be filing in all night. We are here at the early stages around 10 o'clock, uh, and we already see the crowd is rolling in, plenty of parking space. Uh, tell us uh, what has been the response to the community fun day from the community in the past. Well, the event was set to start at 8.30. There are people here at 7.30. So they're excited, they're ready. Um, it's a need in the community. And as you just look around, there are people everywhere. There's kids everywhere. We have great a uh, kid center set up. So they are, they're coming out, they're looking for the service. I see bounce houses, I see games out there for the children. Yeah. My little boy is out here, he's over there having a great time. Uh, it is just, it, it, it's actually community fun. Now, them, uh, being able to provide these children with free haircuts, bicycle giveaway, flat screen TV, uh, 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 school supplies, what does that do in terms of our community uh, everybody helping each other. 
I think it shows that we uh, we always hear people say uh, it takes a village to raise a child. It, sometimes when you're older, you still need a little raising. So whatever that need may be, uh, that's why we have the church in the community, and it helps us feel like we're giving some back. As little or as much as we may have, we can all give something. Martin, what is your role here today? My role here is I'm doing uh, helping with logistics as well as making sure. Um, some of the marketing things are done right, and um, the vendors are all good. Can you, when we're done with this interview in a second, can you make sure you get uh, Sister Glover over here? I know she's working hard. We'll make sure she's here, our um, chairperson of our Redeeming Influence Community Outreach Organization, as well as our First Lady. All right, let's get some people over here. You're looking live again as our cameraman pans at the Community Fund Day here at Mount Hermon Ministries. People are coming out here on this Saturday. We got the sun out. We got the media here. Lee Pitts Live is a media sponsor. I'm here with my good friend, the future mayor of Fort Myers. And, and shortly, I expect to be talking to the mayor of Fort Myers. All that's happening on Lee Pitts Live. We'll be right back.